Well hello again and welcome back to Mas Palomas. Tonight we're going to try and get some sunset shots with the lighthouse and possibly some late night vision long exposure stuff. Hopefully you're getting the illuminated safe front, that type of thing. We'll see what kind of images we can get. Again, using the Panasonic FZ82, I do have some ND filters and things like that, so I might have a quick go at some seascape stuff before the sun goes down. So we'll catch you in a bit. So there we have the subject for this evening's vlog behind me there. The lighthouse, hope you can hear me over the crashing waves. It's absolutely fantastic here. The sun's going to be setting in about half an hour, I think. Pretty much worked out what I'm going to do composition-wise. Definitely the lighthouse, some of the rocks in the foreground, maybe, and uh, a lovely sunset. So yeah, it doesn't look as if it's going to be a great evening for a sunset. We've got this bank of cloud that's rolled in off the sea and the sun's kind of dipping into that at the moment. We ne you never know, we're not going to give up just yet. Hopefully the sky might catch. This is the only day that's forecast for any cloud so I was hoping that we would get um, some nice high cloud and perhaps uh, that would be illuminated by the setting sun. We'll see what we'll get. We've still got some night photography to do so Hopefully once Mas Palomas lights up for the evening, we can get some photographs of that. So stick around and we'll see those photos later. So here we are again, 24 hours later, hoping that the sky is going to kick off tonight. Um, it was a bit of a disappointment early on last night, and then all of a sudden, after I'd packed up and gone away from the scene, sure enough, 20 past 8, the sky bright red. Absolutely fantastic sunset. I did race back, but I wasn't able to get here before the light faded. So hopefully, we can do something with the sky as it's happening behind us tonight. So currently this is going to be a bit of a challenge for the FZ82. Remember it is a small sensor on this camera and low light isn't its favourite subject. I am shooting at about a 4 second exposure, ISO 80. Uh, thankfully the camera is on a tripod, hopefully it's going to pick out some detail in the sky and we'll get a decent shot. So I've had to switch the camera into scene mode and use artistic nightscape. I don't think four seconds is going to be quite long enough now that it's got a little bit darker. Hopefully this pink is going to keep on coming and we're going to get a great sky. If not, and we hate it, it gets dark and then I'll give up. So by the end of that vlog you could see I was a little bit despondent, I was a little bit disappointed with the weather conditions we had, sunset didn't quite kick off as much as I'd like to have, the tide could have been in which would have given some motion in the foreground which would have been ideal, but you've got to work with what you've got, uh, you only had a week to go out and shoot and um, yeah it was a holiday as well so Obviously my partner didn't want to be uh, with me taking photographs all the time. So we made the best of what we could in the time we had. I think, um, yeah, 
if it had been the UK, I could have gone and looked at apps and picked the best uh, weather conditions to go out to shoot a certain location. But as I say, we just had the week. As ever, thank you very much for watching this vlog. It really does mean a lot to me that you spend your time watching my content. If, of course, you'd like to watch more, then please do feel free to watch another couple of videos. It really does help with my watch time for this channel. And, again, if you're not a subscriber, please hit that red subscribe button. If you've enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. That really helps with the algorithm. And, of course, if you'd like to support the channel financially, there is a Buy Me A Coffee link in the description below. That just leaves me to say thank you very much again for watching this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.